up guys? Welcome back! This is Game of Thrones by Telltale Games. I'm Odigai on the Casual Gamer's Nest and we are at the Royal Wedding. Marjorie's wedding to Joffrey! Yay! As, as a handmaiden, I'm sitting and watching from the side because Marjorie is furious at me for talking to a Lannister, to Tyrion Lannister specifically. And I think Sarah is also kind of pissed at me. Let's see what's gonna happen. When I was getting her dressed for the wedding, she was talking about who she could replace you with. <gasps> I probably shouldn't have even told you, but I suppose you have a right to know. I can handle this. She's only thinking about it, right? There's still time. Look, you once promised to help me with Marjorie when our positions were reversed. That meant everything to me. Maybe now I'm in a position to help you. Otherwise, Marjorie's going to make you leave King's Landing. You're pushing her to it, Mira. And I can't let you. You're making a lot of drama out of nothing, Sarah. This will pass. Marjorie and I will be friends again. I'm not going anywhere. For your sake, Mira, I hope you're right. Look, the pie! Oh no! They're already serving the pie. Oi! We're missing everything. You again. I know you. And I know you. You were in the gardens the other night, with Damien. Before he disappeared. I have a few questions to ask you. What were you doing there with him? M Mira? Don't think I don't know it was you. So what if I was with him? No. Uh. Seven hells. <sighs> you there, girl. I need a towel or a wet cloth, something. Lord Morgren. You'll need to find someone else. I'm not finished Are with her. Are you sick, man? You think I have time to bother with handmaidens? Release her or I'll have Queen Cersei find you another job. Ugh. What a brute, but... He saved my life. Kind of. Well, I just ruined a perfectly good shirt to come to your rescue. No need to explain what that was all about. We all have our own mischief to hide. That was kind of you. I do appreciate it. Well, I didn't do it merely for your benefit. Then why? Perhaps I recognize a kindred spirit. It's not every little handmaiden who can steal an ironwood decree with the crown right out from under my nose. Consider me impressed. My partners, I am afraid to say, felt rather differently about it. That ironwood was stolen from my family. It was never yours to sell. Spoken with strength, my lady. But still, I wonder if you're ready to play this game. Do you even understand why Tyrion gave you the Ironwood deal? Because it wasn't out of the kindness of his heart. I'm no fool. He wants something from me. Access to Marjorie. Or, perhaps he just knew he could get the cheapest Ironwood from me. Very observant. You are no mere handmaiden. I remember what it was like to be new to this game. You feel like you're drowning, don't you? There's no one you can really trust. What you need more than anything is an ally. I could be that for you, Lady Mira. Is that something you'd be interested in? I don't know you, my lord. I have no reason to trust you. I can do just fine on my own. Can you? Circumstances have put us at odds. But what if we were to work together? control the price of ironwood together. We could get very, very rich together. Or should I go back to Lud Whitehill? Who has proven to be very interested in it? The king is dead. Long live the king. Oh, 
What happened? Joffrey's dead! I'm afraid it just became a very bad time to be linked to Tyrion Lannister. Tell me that you got that Ironwood decree from him before the wedding. Oh no. He said it was waiting for me on his desk. <sighs> what a shame. Such potential. I'm afraid any chance of our alliance has become quite impossible. You understand, Lady Mira. I can get it. I'll get it back from his chamber. That would not be an easy task, especially now. But if it were to disappear, perhaps we could talk again. You have a good head for business, Lady Mira. It'd be terribly disappointing to see it on the end of a pike. I'll take my chances. Oh, shit. Why should I be caught running at this point? Okay, okay. Um... Listen, is anybody inside? They're probably it's locked. <gasps> Not getting in this way. Tom! What in seven hells do you think you're doing up here? What are you thinking? Tom, I'm in trouble. There's something inside I need to get. If I don't, it's going to be a nightmare. Damn it. Whatever trouble you're in could be trouble for me too. So what do we do? I have an idea. The terrace. The what? I could maybe climb across the roof and drop down onto the outside terrace. It's just... I don't know, Mira. Is whatever's in there really worth risking my life for? It's not just kings who die stupidly round here. Tom, I really need your help here. I can't do this alone. Just be careful. Wait here. I'll be at the door before you know it. Man, he's, he's actually doing it. Just what do you think you're doing here? You shouldn't be anywhere near this place. Don't you know the imp has murdered the king? I'm sorry. I was just... I'm leaving right now. Not so fast. I'm not going to ask you again. Oi! Whoever's in there, I command you to open this door at once! In the name of the king! The king is dead. There's no king. Your argument is invalid. You! Don't move! Tom! It's me! Hurry! Gods, that was close. I almost didn't make it back down here. Some tiles on the roof came loose. Almost lost my footing. Thank you, Tom. I could never have done this without you. I'm looking for a piece of paper. A royal decree. Well, go on. That Lannister guard could be back with help any second. I'll keep watch outside the door. Tom! You can do this. Uh, I'm desperate. All right, all right, all right, all right. A royal decree. Desk. Desk, desk, desk. He, he said that it's... He said that it would be on his desk. Yes, that's what he said. Uh, look at... Tyrion's strongbox. Oh, it must be in here. Mira, I think the Lannister guard is back. Fuck me. It's the other one. Damn it. Hide. I find a way to distract them. Uh, how? What? Uh, I'm telling you, I heard someone in here. Search the place. We'll find them. And after. Now that we've got the imp's keys, we can have a little look inside his lockboxes, eh? <laughs> Bingo! Aye. Fuck. Go away. Shoot, shoot. Damn it. Help! Fire! What the hell? Damn it! Come on! Uh, that was a close one. Now, the keys. The lockbox. You did it. How? I lit a tapestry on fire down the hall. 
I bought you a minute, maybe two. Oh, thank you. Did you find it? Oh, I think... I think it has to be in here. Oh, it has to be. Let's go for the middle. Oh, I didn't click on the middle. No, no, no. Just hurry. I'm trying. <gasps> it worked. Is this? Oh, thank the gods. Oh, I found it. Finally. Let's go. I catch the bastard who <laughs> look oh, at the bozo bloody neck. <laughs> See you later, suckers. We're not far now. Gwyn Whitehill may already be there. What is this? Our ironwood trees. It's the White Hills. You see what they've done? This track was hundreds of years old. And they reduced it to nothing. We've no time to waste. We must take back what's ours before all the ironwood is gone. I, the White Hills, need to answer for this. And Gwyn needs to answer for this. But we need to find out what she knows. She'll be over there. Be cautious, my lord. If she go around her father to help us, she must have some purpose. I'll hear what she has to say, but I won't forget who she is. Good. You see what her family's done here? Here. You might want this. You may have known each other since you were children, but this could be a trap. Doesn't hurt to be careful. Go on. I'll stay with the horses. How far is it? I'm a cripple. Oh, I'm I'm holding the knife. I'm not hiding the knife. Um this is not very discreet. And I don't like it. Walk faster. There we go. <laughs> I see you haven't lost your warrior's ways. That's good. I wouldn't want to deal with someone careless. Hello, Gwyn. It's... It's been so long since we've met, Roderick. It has. It was before your father found out about you and Asher. Before he stormed Ironrath. You saw my father's work over there, didn't you? And he won't stop. He means to do that to every inch of your land. I have to stop this. It can't go on. I know. You have to trust me. I don't agree with my father's ways. <sighs> I wasn't sure you were even going to show. We're taking a risk, meeting like this. Well, I came. So let us get to the business that brings us here. Yes. We should get on with it. I think we can help each other. But first, I... I've heard news of Asher. That he plans to return to Ironrath. Why is he coming back? I loved him once. I longed for Asher to come back. But not like this. How do you know about my brother? That's part of why I'm here. But I need to know you've come for the same reasons I have. I want peace between our families. No more wars. No more bloodshed. Is that what you want too? I need to hear you say it, Roderick. Will you work with me to bring an end to this war? I want to know the price before I agree to pay it. I'm no fool. It seems that you are. Because you clearly don't understand. Peace is the only hope your family has. My father is just waiting for an excuse to attack. Why do you think he sent my brother? So there will be trouble. My father will bring utter ruin on your house. Unless... You let Griff feel like he's in control. Just like you kissed my father's ring. 
You must show the same respect to Griff. I'll put on a good face and let him think whatever he likes, if that's what I have to do. It is. My lord, a band of riders approach from the north. Seven hills. My father's guards must be tracking me. If they catch us here, they'll kill you. Then we've no time to waste. Let's get on with it. My father is planning to make a move against your family. I don't know all the details, but he's been sending a great deal of gold to someone in King's Landing. I fear for your family, Roderick. You may think you've nothing more to lose. He is ready to show you otherwise. What the hell is your father planning? I swear I don't know, but whatever it is, he knows all your weaknesses, all your plans. What? How? Because you have a traitor in your council. Someone who knows every detail of your circumstances. My father boasts of it. You must tell me. Who is it? I don't know. We know you're planning to rescue Ryan. Even if it means abandoning your home to Griff. What? My father's guards are close. I need to know you'll do what I've asked. Promise me you'll submit to Griff. If you want peace between our families, it's the only way. You have my word, Gwyn. I'll do my part. Thank you. My lord, those riders are nearly upon us. We have to go. What I told you. Be careful what you do with it. And remember, I'll hear about it if you don't. My lord? Come along, Duncan. God, so there's a spy in the council. It could be anybody. It could be Duncan, it could be Royland, uh, the mother, Maester. Who, who, who else is in the council? Hold on. I cannot think of somebody else not right now. But what if it's, <laughs> what if it's the mother? Oh my, <laughs> oh lord. Mother. Roderick. Look at what's become of our house. You were nowhere to be found and they just... Oh, they are vile men. Where were you? We need you here. To hold this house together. I've uncovered some troubling news. What's wrong? Lord Whitehill is plotting against us. I don't know his plans, but I fear them. And the only way he'll stop is if we submit to Griff's rule of our house. What? Would you really give up control of our house? Griff is already a torment. How much worse could it get? I have to keep the peace with Griff, even if that means letting him have his way at times. The thought of it makes me ill. I don't like it either. Was this all? Did you learn anything more? You need to tell me. Enough with the mysteries, my son. Is it not bad enough for you already? It's bad enough having their soldiers in our house. But if you won't be open with me, then our problems run deeper. <laughs> Go on. Go on. <laughs> Get in Oi, there. Lord Ethan! Don't get in there. You do what you're told. <laughs> no, please, I'm oh, oh, just a wee boy. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, he was standing over there. No, he he fucking was. No, I'll no, handle it. Over there. You know. Fuck off you again. Get down there. Get off again. Get down there and die. He's standing over there. <laughs> what do you want from me? No, no, he was over there. And Ramsay was yeah, here. I'll play how I want. You will bend the knee to your liege lord. I must speak true. I haven't the balls to defy you, Lord oh, Ramsay. Oh, would you be so much more fun if you fought back? Now, give me a wood, boy. Oh, I heard tales of your cruelty, Lord Ramsay. But in my short life, I've never seen such a foul cat. Brave words. Huh? Okay, okay. We'll be pausing for now, and I'll see you all in the next episode of Game of Thrones by Telltale Games. 
A ver, por aqui é um de casual gamers nest, and this is going pretty interesting. We have a spy in the council, and we're trying to find who it is. And I'm not trusting anybody yet, not even my mother. Uh, so we'll uh, stick to the plan and give Griff what he wants, and you know, let's pretend that he's the master of this house, the lord of this house for now. And I'll see you on the next episode, which is coming soon. So stay tuned and keep on gaming. Love you all. Bye bye.